today I have properly cut onions. <laughs> First, what we're going to do is make a tomato-based meat mixture. It's kind of similar to like bolognese sauce, but better. First, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna chop these onions, but I'm gonna do this without a knife. Ready? All I'm gonna do is just toss them in the air and chop them with my hands. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three, go. Whoa! <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> my shot. Next step after chopping your onions with no knife is skinning your tomatoes. We're gonna skin the tomatoes, not unlike unlike skinning the heads of people. <laughs> I think you would know. Uh, we're gonna be skinning these tomatoes oh, or tomatoes or, or potatoes. Um, but but really, what's gonna happen is we're gonna cut a kind of a crisscross through the top of the tomato, like so. We're gonna then boil it and parboil it in some water. And as it boils, what will happen is the skin will start peeling and be easy to remove. I uh, um, heated the tomatoes up, it's really just all it is, is just peeling the skin off. <laughs> I put it in a cold ice bath as well so that uh, it helps with the process and helps with my hands because they're burning right now <laughs> from fire. That's not a tablespoon. <laughs> <laughs> that was two tablespoons of chili sauce. <laughs> What's the most embarrassing memory of like something that you cooked? My first crepe and I tried to toss it and it stuck on the floor. And then Kevin made fun of me. You psychic narrating! I'll <laughs> repeat the story. I made a crepe. I fell on the floor. <laughs> the end. Kevin laughed at me. The end. So we've chopped up our onions. I mean, <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> heat it up, and then once it's... Wow, this is a... Shimmer in, then you can cut the heat. Alright, Nathan's gonna, he's gonna do a taste test of the meat that's raw. <laughs> Please comment down below if you think we look alike. I don't think we do. They both wear glasses. That's all I have to say. We also have bushy eyebrows. If I had no eyebrows. They don't look alike. Thank you. <laughs> we need salt. We need salt, guys. Need salt. Ow. As you can see, the sauce is getting thicker now with the inclusion of the meat. Get those and tomatoes. my arm is also becoming part of the meat. You want to trade out? Maybe. And then... Oh, it's red. <laughs> Wait, what the Aww. So this is definitely more than six to eight servings. <laughs> I think it's about four to five. Oh, wait. Wait. <laughs> wait, what? what? <laughs> <laughs> four to five servings? <laughs> four people? <laughs> no, no. Wait, how many are we trying to make full? Fourteen. Fourteen. Oh, 14. <laughs> we add some water, let it simmer down, and make a nice sauce. For 30 minutes. Oh, we'll add a little picket. Why food poisoning again tomorrow because I lived at Rocky? <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> That's dangerous. We are safe in this household, we promise. <laughs> oh, were you picking your tool? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Again, imagine that you have your worst enemy. This is multiple coronas. <laughs> it's coming out of the bag. No. That is quite fitting because we have tried to beat down corona, but it's still coming it's out coming of the bag. <laughs> it's still coming back. It's escaping. <laughs> I'm um, losing! <laughs> so if we all stay at home, we'll be able to beat Corona as fast as Kevin smashed these peanuts. God, that was hard. <laughs> Alright, so the next, next step is to blanch these noodles and get them ready for mixing. Ta-da! Guys, here we have uh, close to a finished product. As you can see, the star anise has really seeped into the pork. I wish you could smell this because it's... It's amazing. But anyway, as you can see, the pork's coagulated nicely and combined with the uh, umami of the potatoes. Tomatoes. <laughs> potatoes. Oh and the star anise <laughs> just smells friggin' amazing. So, we have grandma here <laughs> assembling our shankasuet. <laughs> so, so the Usually, first we add the meat sauce. That we have been simmering for like, I don't even know, 50 minutes now. And after this, she's gonna add all of our other toppings, which include black bean, crushed peanuts, green onion, chili oil if you like more spice, fried tofu, pickled mustard, and then blanched snow pea tips. Okay. Ta -da. Ta da! You gotta mix it. Final product. Guess who prepared which bowl? <laughs> <laughs>
从一到一到十，你给几分？八分，八分。为什么我是马赛？Yeah。从一到十，你给几分？你我你妈妈做的给十分，你这个只有六分。Oh my God! You know what? He knows though, my mom. This recipe is actually from my other grandma, who you'll see in a little bit. Um, who's from the Shan State, and so my mom's recipe um, is this actually. So today's episode is more like cooking for grandma instead of cooking with grandma, <laughs> but we improvise. Today we have a special guest, my other grandma, who I call Papa. So Papa, where are you from? I'm Papa Monwa. So she's from Monwa in Burma, and mm -hmm. where else did you live in, in Myanmar? Amani, you know, a this is the other translator. This is my so, uncle. Uh, so what she was saying is that um, she moved to the Shan State later on um, when my grandpa, her husband, became a manager. And so they moved to the Shan State, which is where the big Shan Ka Swag comes from. Yeah. And she has three children, one of them is my uncle over here, my mom, and then one other uncle who lives elsewhere. So what is Shan Ka Swai? What does it mean to you? Shan Ka Swai is a good one. Shan Ka Shan Ka Swai is like making with the uh, Shan rice, you know, traditional. So they always eat every morning. Usually it's like a breakfast dish, yeah, but breakfast. we like to eat it all the time because it's really good. Yeah. yeah. What is it like living in the Shan state? Yeah, so Shan state is a very mountainous area um, up in northern Myanmar, so it's not as hot. But other grandma who we were cooking with for Shan Ka Swe, um, they live in Yangon. It's really hot and humid. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Tune in next week for another episode of Cooking, Cooking with, with Grandma. Grandma. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Ready? I don't even need a knife. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. my god. Yes. Ready? Am I in the same place? Yep. Whoa! Look at it!